Hey guys, Wade Neely here, Director of Athletic Communications for Martin Methodist College. I'm in my eighth season. Good to be with you guys this afternoon, talking with our Red Hawk Executive Director of Athletics, Mr. Jeff Bain. Jeff, good to be with you as always. Before we get started, however, we got to give a shout out to our main man, Rowdy Red Hawk, back-to-back -back champs in the Southern States Athletic Conference mascot challenge. A big social media win last night for the Red Hawks. It really was. And what's really cool about that is what you said, social media. Uh, and the social media world now, it kind of sets your brand, who, it, who you are, uh, your perception that people have of you. And for the smallest school in the conference to walk away with the most social media votes is pretty unique. And in fact, it's accolades to you our Director of Athletic Communications and the network that you've built social media. So congratulations to you and Sir Rowdy. Good win for Rowdy, back-to-back -back titles for uh, Mr. Red Hawk. And uh, Jeff, speaking of Rowdy Red Hawk, speaking of uh, a big campaign, we want to talk to the fans today and our parents, our friends and alumni about a big push uh, on social media. Coming up, what can you tell us about Wednesday, February 26th, our first ever Red Hawk Day of Giving? Uh, two things I guess I'll throw out to you about that. One is that it's going to be an opportunity for people who haven't given in a while to, to give to the athletic department. Uh, it's, a, it's an easy way to give. It's the current trends in social media and the easy clicks of the internet as opposed to a lot of postal mail, snail mail, and knocks on doors. It's a great way for people to get involved who haven't had a chance. It's also an opportunity for us to, ex to expand our brand again to let people know that we've got first class opportunities to give and to develop relationships. Uh, the second part about it is how important it is right now. The mm -hmm. timing is perfect. Sesquicentennial year coming up that we're in right now, 150th year of Martin Methodist College. Uh, every institution in athletic at some point outgrows what the institution can provide, and especially when you have success. And we're at that point at Martin Methodist College. We need the people that are alumni of the college, friends of the college, uh, to give and help support what we're trying to do, our student athletes. I think one of the interesting things about this campaign is that it's A, grassroots, but B, uh, each sport is gonna benefit directly. Um, there were some questions, you know, if my money is gonna end up in a different sports uh, pocket, so to speak, but this is gonna be dialed in. When your donation goes directly to soccer program, it stays with that program. It goes to softball, it stays there. 100% of it. And the unique thing about it is, that our coaches are going to be in the grassroots. We've got a war room set up. They're going to be uh, going through entire all the different social media channels to reach out to the people that they've got. And as that opportunity unfolds, uh, we're going to really count donors, not necessarily the money. Uh, we're trying to get 150 overall new donors to the athletic department on this day. Uh, so 150 new donors, 150th anniversary, it all kind of dovetails in together. One thing I like about that too, $12.50, you may not seem like a huge gift monthly, but you add that up for 12 months, 150 total dollars, even the smallest can afford to give on, on that scale. And that's why you hit the nail on the head, Grassroot Foundation. Uh, what we want to be able to do is go, if you want to be in the President's Club at $1,000, uh, we'll go after that gift if you want to, or the very simplistic, most important gifts maybe at $12.50 a month for a year, hits our sesquicentennial goal of $150. Well, you can easily sign me up for the $12.50 a month. Uh, that will uh, certainly go to the sports information budget. We look forward to that. Uh, but Jeff, uh, final thoughts. Uh, one thing you really mentioned too, I like that. Uh, this is gonna be mobile friendly as well for the Red Hawks to just get the phone out and donate in a hurry. We, we think, as you know, we've been planning this for like six months. Uh, we think we've got all of the uh, tweaks and things to make it be successful, that it's something when the grand totals are over with, all the alumni that have given, I go, you know, I've been really part of something special. The great thing about this campaign is it gives us a chance to enhance our image and our brand that we've created. We're known to be the home of academic All-Americans, athletic All-Americans, national champions, and our Champions of Character programming with our life skills. So it is a very strong opportunity for the alumni and friends of the college to help build that brand further. Couldn't have said it any better, folks. Uh, as uh, we get ready to celebrate our first ever Red Hawk Athletic Day of Giving, we are the home of academic All-Americans, athletic All-Americans, national champions, and champions of character. I've seen it in my eight years. You've seen it in your 20 plus years. The cool thing about this uh, final note, Jeff, is that uh, we're going worldwide with this thing. We've got alumni all across the globe. Uh, a lot of folks will be afforded the opportunity to tune in and to pitch in on Wednesday, February 26th. At 10 a.m. We're actually going to track the number of states that we get donations from, the number of countries you get donation donations from, and per sport we get donation. Like I said, it's a donation count not necessarily a money count. We're wanting to see how many people we can reconnect as we move into the next 150 years. 
Jeff, as always, we thank you for your time. We look forward to Wednesday, February 26th. At 10 a.m. At 10 a.m., folks. It's going to be fun. Our first ever Red Hawk Athletic Day of Giving. I'm Wayne Neely saying so long. We will see you at 10 a.m. Be there and be online as the Red Hawks celebrate our first ever Red Hawk Athletic Day of Giving.